Rome's most popular foundation myth is about two descendants of the gods, the twin brothers Romulus and Remus. Left to die by their jealous uncle, the brothers were raised by a female wolf. When they grew older, they decided to build a city in the hills, but fought over which hill should be the site of their soon-to-be-prosperous city. So Romulus chose a hill and built a wall around it, and Remus chose a hill and built a wall around it. After Remus mockingly jumped over Romulus's wall, Romulus killed him, and named the city Rome, after himself. He then went on to found a city built on blood and death. <laughs> said that they were most peaceful at that time and they achieved that by as you saw in the video conquering every city around them and uh, a main one was Carthage which Durban will talk about later and they destroyed everything in the city and then left salt so nothing could grow back ever so they were really brutal the army was brutal but uh, after conquering everybody they had more peace in the city so it helped them become a more successful city, but the empire was kind of bloody and brutal. But uh, that was the Pectrum one. My, my topic was on the Punic Wars, and um, I based my commercial mainly on the Third Punic War, which was when um, it happened after Hannibal conquered a bunch of Roman cities, um, and the Romans fought Carthage once more after, like, for the third time. And the Romans won again, and after they won, they um, put salt into their crop fields so nothing could grow. And then they burned down their, all their cities so no one could live, really. And then they, they enslaved all their people. And they did this because they thought it would bring more peace to their country and it wouldn't start a civil war. The brother's father was a descendant of the gods. This means that the Romans are descendants of the gods. This means that the Romans are favored by the gods. So even though this myth is filled with deceit, jealousy, and death, much like ancient Rome itself, it actually puts the Romans into a good light. <laughs> 